Hello YouTube, I'm Frogman Forever, and this is the third set of my Let's Play of Super Mario World. We are about to start on World 5, but I need to mention something very important. Look what happens when we go back down into World 5. <laughs> You'll notice that all of these levels have been completed. <laughs> Let me explain. Okay, so basically, I, in, in a nutshell, because I don't want to bore you with too much detail, but this is not, this is obviously not the first time I've tried recording since I last recorded. Uh, <laughs> and um, I started recording and I ended up saving because you can save here at the Blue Palace and you can save again here at the Ghost House and I ended up saving and then I decided uh, I didn't really like the way the recording was going. And, but it was too late by that point. I had already saved the game, and so, yeah. So, I don't want to cheat anyone and just move on with the game. I want to continue from where I left off, and I left off at Forest Evolution, level 1 of World 5. So that's where we're going to begin. We're going to go ahead and do these. Now, one slight little change, though, as well. Um, whenever you beat the palaces, you can't do them again. So, but there's, there's good news to that. I still have the footage, of course, um, of me actually beating the Blue Palace. So what I'm going to do is I'll probably show you the footage of me beating it, and then I'll post-commentate over that footage. Um, <laughs> but that'll be the only thing that I post-commentate. I don't like post-commentating. I, I, I just don't whatsoever. I hope never to do it, you know, for a full episode. But... Um, in this circumstance, because I want to show you what the Blue Palace looks like at the very least, I'm going to do that. Let's go ahead and begin, and then I'll kind of catch us up a little bit more on what we're doing now. Um, so, Forest of Illusion Level 1. My recording software is already glitchy, so I think I'm going to have to... Um, let me start all over. I'll, I'll meet you back here. Okay, I'm back. Um, yeah, I need. I don't know if I actually fixed the, the lag problem, but... Um, Whatever, I'm gonna, yeah, okay, it looks like it's working a lot better now. Okay, so, um, basically, uh, today is December 18th. I know that it's not necessary to say that, but I'm doing it for my Let's Play. Uh, every time I record, I'm gonna say what day it is that I'm recording for my own personal record. Today is December 18th. Um, I don't know what day this video is being posted, uh, ep episode 13, that is. But, um, I would imagine it wouldn't be too far off from December 18th. Um, I, it is, the, like, the holidays, and so I do have a little bit more time to do that, I think. Um, so hopefully it won't be too far off from December 18th from when this video gets posted. But, um, yeah, I last recorded October 19th, so that's about two full months, uh, ago. And so it's been a while. I have, I'm a little out of practice. Um, but, uh... Yeah, uh, I've been pretty busy the past two months with work and all that jazz, um, and I'm really just excited to be back, as always. Um, I want to welcome everyone who's watching. Um, if you are still with me, despite the kind of sloppy beginning and my explanations and all that stuff, um, I, I want to welcome everyone back. Thank you so much for being here. Um, your support is always appreciated. Um, those of you who are subscribed to my channel, thank you so very much. Um, I don't know if you're watching all my videos, but if you are, uh, it means a lot to me. It really does. Um, this is the first uh, exit. It's the secret exit in this level, so we're going to go ahead and clear that out of the way. And what happens when you get that secret exit is you can access the ghost house over here. Okay, I'm going to play it again so you can see the main exit. I know it sounds unnecessary, but honestly, I, I feel like I, I cheated you all when I didn't, uh, when I screwed that up, and I, I didn't, when I, when I accidentally saved when I, when I shouldn't have, and I canceled that last recording, um, so I, I want to make sure I play every single level so that you all can see that, yes, it is in fact me playing all the levels, and I'm very capable of doing so. Um, I want to say I'm, I'm very glad to be back, um, you know, recording for me is always therapeutic, and uh, things have been rough these past two months, but honestly, they've always been rough uh, since March, uh, me looking for a job, so, um, 
And, and I, I don't say rough in a negative, like, you know, horrible things happen, although there have been some, some things that have happened that have been very unfortunate. Um, but uh, it's just mainly been busy and, and it's been hard to record. So, um, you know, even in the darkest times for me, you know, playing video games has always been uh, very therapeutic and um, so much fun. And, and especially playing, you know, these classic Super Nintendo games, which are my favorite, uh, like Super Mario World. Very, uh, they're very therapeutic for me, and I really, I really enjoyed playing them. So, um, I want to welcome those of you who are subscribers and those of you who aren't. Uh, whether you've clicked on my link or not um, on purpose, maybe you hit it on accident, who knows. But uh, I want to thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. I know that there are all kinds of Let's Plays uh, of Super Mario World that you could be choosing. But if you stumbled upon mine and you happen to be watching it, thank you. Um, if you care to like, comment, subscribe to my channel, always appre that's always appreciate appreciated. And um, if not, if you want to uh, leave constructive criticism or dislike, you know, that's fine. Um, I'm not saying, hey, I welcome dislikes. It makes me sad. But um, but I do really appreciate constructive criticism. So if you have a comment, if you want to tell me, hey, don't, don't, you don't really have to do this. Or, hey, maybe you should try doing this more, blah, 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 whatever. You know, I welcome that. When I completed the main exit on this level, we opened up Force of Illusion 2. So I'm going to go ahead and there are actually two exits in this level as well. There's actually multiple exits in most of the levels in World 5. So um, that's what we're going to do here. We're going to do the secret exit first. And uh, when you hit this first secret exit, you're going to encounter the key and keyhole, which are going to access the Switch Palace. Um, and again, when we get to that point, I will show you um, the the post commentary uh, and, and the original footage of when I first completed that Switch Palace. All right. Um, uh, let's see. What else is there that I want to say? Um, since it's the first episode, I feel like I should mention. Um, I know it's still kind of early, but I am already starting to think about what my next Let's Play is going to be, um, what game I'm going to play next. And I want to remind people watching that um, I do have access to a lot of different games, um, mostly on the emulators that I have on my Nintendo Wii. Um, so if I have the Wii, you know I can play GameCube games on that, obviously. But I do have emulators for... Oh, crap. I do have emulators for the... Uh, Nintendo, the Atari, the Super Nintendo, the Sega Genesis. Um, and I think that's it. But then I also have the PlayStation 1, 2, and 3. These are games, these are systems that I've collected over the years. Um, certainly not something that I've... I've you know, collected or, or had for a long time. I, I'd like to think that I take at least decent care of my games because I've, I've been able to, to to keep a lot of the systems I've had for a while. But um, I, I, I know that I could always take better care of my games, that's for sure. But anyway, um, the, the point of all that is what I, what I wanted to get to was the, was the whole, you know, I am thinking about what I want to play next, and um, but I also want to get kind of um, some input on it too. If you have any games that you want to suggest that I play, especially on those uh, emulators that I have since I have access to all of those libraries, um, please feel free to leave that in the comment because uh, I'm trying to open up some possibilities. By the way, so when you open up that key palace, then you open up the blue switch palace. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to pause for a minute and um, I'm going to let you see me complete the blue switch palace, but with my post commentary. Again, I don't like doing post commentary, but I'm going to do it for the sake of just kind of the circumstances and how I can't play it again. So at least I don't think you can. I don't think you can. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and switch to my old footage. Hey guys, this is Frogman Forever post commentating for you on January 30th. I understand that's late, and I apologize. You put the key into the keyhole, you take the fish with you, and that'll send your way to the Blue Switch Palace. Uh, so yeah, um, post commentating here, uh, not my not my thing, uh, but uh, I appreciate those of you watching. I apologize for those of you watching this and realizing, hey, this whole episode's kind of been a, a, a channel update video, but um, you know what are you gonna do? Uh, <laughs> and um, yeah, basically, uh, this, this level's pretty cool. Look, uh, magic trick, magic trick, watch this. See the coins fall? Alright, turn around, they're there at the top. 
See, I got magic coin spawning abilities. All right, so anyway, yeah, you just grab the coins. Pretty straightforward bonus round. Most of them are. Um, some of them have a little bit of a puzzle, but you know, I, I don't. I don't like to make a big thing out of them. They're just bonus levels. So anyway, it's kind of weird because I'm I'm from the future here. Um, but I'm gonna send it back to Frogman Forever from the past. Peace. Okay, so welcome back. Um, that's the Switch Palace. Now, I, I'm going to play this underwater level again because you need to access the path that will open up to Forest of Illusion 3. And the way you do that is by completing Forest of Illusion. Uh, or excuse me, yeah, Forest of Illusion 2 again, but you have to do the main exit. Uh, I feel like I'm still forgetting to mention something. Um... I don't know if I mentioned, but the last episode of Set 2 was posted on December 9th. That was about nine days ago. And I figured, you know, it's been nine days, I'm out of footage, I don't have any other videos to upload. It's about as good of a day as any to, uh, to record, so that's what I'm doing. Um, world 5 is not my favorite world. Actually, I'd probably say it's one of my least favorite worlds because because of how like indirect it is it's like there's multiple exits like in, ev in almost every level and, and you're always like if you want hundred percent the game which uh, it seems to be what I'm what I'm kind of trying to do um, then you have to replay a lot of the levels and you have to get all the exits and everything and so it's not that big a deal um, but it's kind of annoying um, but it just really just depends. I mean, honestly, I don't mind too much. I know I sound, I know I just said it was kind of annoying, but I think it's mainly because, at least, at least due to all the technical difficulties I've been going through, I've had to play these levels like multiple times, and so maybe I'm just getting a little tired of them. But uh, you know, to be completely honest with you, uh, I really do, I really do enjoy playing these levels, and it's fun. I mean, like I enjoy playing all the levels in the game. I just love playing the game. Period. I don't know how I got three lives there. I think because I killed so many enemies all at once. Oh, well, anyway. Alright. So I wanted to show you that, yes, in fact, you can go ahead and, and you know, clear both paths and, and open up this Force of Illusion 3. 